still not we're not a, we are not a, we are not a team this is this is this is not the competition we're not a team this is a competition one mic one pair one in a million uh -huh. i'm playing rap stop pound and stop bg bell yeah. oh. what you looking at come on what you waiting for come on All right, you guys, so I'm back, and it's super, super, super excited. Uh, I get to talk about one of my favorite shows of this past year, Unpretty Rap Star. Um, Jesse, Kisam, Jolly V, we've got Taimi, Rapper G-Man, we have Yuk Ji Dam, Jace, and everyone's favorite internet meme, Lil Chami, uh, season one's group. We're back with, and Cheetah, how can I forget about Cheetah? Uh, we're back, and Jesse. we're back with season two, and I'm super duper excited with some of the names they announced. It looks like the, uh, the producers kind of listened to the fans and actually pulled some actual underground rappers this time, and not just, you know, show me the money, girls. Uh, so I'm really excited about that. Real quick, let's go over the lineup of, uh, volume two of Unpretty Rap Star. We've got from Show Me The Money, I'm So Min, um, again, she's a Show Me The Money girl, so, uh, her flow, she's got a cutesy girly flow um so that's something to look forward to if i'm going to compare her to somebody last season as far as flow goes she's going to have a combination she's going to be that cutesy kissam like, when kissam was being cute not deadly rapper kissam cute kissam is her style uh, we've got ash b i love ash b she's going to be cheetah of season two as far as style and like she's got this understated you know, sexiness tour that everybody's gonna like. So Ash B's real dope. We've got one of my absolute favorite Korean rappers, Gilmi. If you don't know Gilmi, listen to her song, Success. That song is so dope. That whole album that that song was on is amazing. I've been listening to Gilmi for a minute. Um, she's probably the most seasoned person of this whole group. Um, she has the most experience. She's more of a higher profile Korean rapper, if that makes any sense. Um, She's performed on like, you know, and then does like weird things like that. Uh, we've got Hayes. She's gonna be, she's got a very exotic more. She's got a Western look, you know. She's got more of a Western look. She looks a little bit like Jesse from uh she looks like Jesse. She may be the season's Jesse, so I'm really excited about that. The next one we got, I'm really super actually we'll save her to the end. We got rapper, we got Casper. Oh my god, Ka I'm, I really, really dig Casper. So, uh, I was hoping for the first season when they announced the show, anyway, um, this was happening, this project was happening, I was hoping Casper got the bid. But I'm really happy to see that underground rappers are getting the opportunity here. Speaking of um, underground rappers, next up we got Kitty B. Kitty B is going to bring the hood to Unpretty Rap Star Volume 2. She's got this edgy street about her. When you want to talk about underground rappers, let's talk about Kitty B. Next up, we've got SUA, SWA, whatever you want to call her. Um, not too familiar with her. I think this is the young lady from YG. She's um, 17 years old. She's going to be the Yuk Jidam of the season. That's it. Um, she's going to be the Yuk Jidam as far as the age. That's what they're going to try to build her as. But she's got mad experience. She's a trainer under YG, so you know she's not going to be terrible. She's going to be good. Um, next up. This is probably going to be this is going to be the sleeper, and you guys are going to fall in love with this girl. This is Trudy. Trudy is amazing. She's got this real old school '90s hip hop flow. She's like a modern version. Uh, I'm not going to mind. I'm not going to say what she's a modern version of because that's like really set the bar high. But she's mad old school. She's got a real '90s flow to her, um, her to her look, to her style, to the way she rhymes, to how she manipulates her words. I really like Trudy. Next up was somebody that we also wanted a lot. For season one, um, Yizzy from Face Star. Um, a lot of fans of Unpretty Rap Star were like, "Why isn't she in the first season?" Along with like Ellie and who else did we say? Oh, uh, Ellie, we wanted we wanted Ashley or Bipa from from Lip Service was another person rapper that we wanted. Yezzy's cool because Yezzy's a rapper. She's a real rapper. She's a rapper before she was you know K-pop. Next up, oh. Somebody we wanted from season one, um, and a lot of people are going to probably give her crap, but Yubin from the Wonder Girls. Uh, the cool thing about Yubin is Yubin is a rapper. A lot of people don't know that, but Yubin actually is a rapper. Yubin has been praised by Tiger JK, who said he wants to work with her so bad, so that's enough for me to say, alright, she gets the nod, she gets the seal of approval. Because if JK wants to work with you as a rapper, you probably have some sort of talent. She's multifaceted. She speaks multiple languages. She's, you know, she has experience on instruments. I think as far as 
spotlight and um, having experience stage presence wise, Eubin gets that with the exception of Gilmy who might have been around not too much shorter but Eubin probably has the longest tenure. Last person on the list and this is where my issue with Unpretty Season 2 is going to happen is Rapper Hillen. Uh, and I'm not for this and they're billing this as a new challenge for her. Hyunin from Sistar, the singer. Korea, Korean say uh, yo, you know, she's Korean Beyonce. And basically is how she's billed. And now she wants to rap. I understand they want to operate as a new challenge. Same thing to do with Jimin. And I understand that this is for face value. But they're already doing things that are going to make me really upset. If you watch the second teaser, everyone else just gets their name and a little bit of information. She's rapper human. Like, you're already trying to force this down our throats. Rapper, Hyolin. And it started off, they didn't announce Hyolin or, or Yubin, but the first teaser, Yubin has a very distinct, you know, bottom profile of her face. As does Hyolin. And we knew immediately, it's very distinct. And they, the producer said no, then they finally announced it because we're not stupid. Um, and we're a week away, so you kind of have to. But Hyolin, as a rapper, I'm not for it. I'm not for it at all. And now they're doing things like they're trying to really push this as though she's been a rapper for a long time because they're releasing. She's been in rap videos and she's rapping now all of a sudden. And I've been a fan of Sistar for a very long time and this is not a thing. I'm not happy about this as a Sistar fan. Um, Yoon Bora, far better rapper who, you know, and didn't Bora just do a rap thing with the girls from Unpretty Season 1? And she doesn't get the nod. I don't like that. Otherwise, I'm super duper excited about on uh, Pretty Volume Two. The lineup is dope. Um, I am again. I'm very upset. I didn't see Sleek in this in this lineup. Cause Sleek is too good to not be here. Um, Ashley on or Pipa is not in there. Um, One Cat from Global Icon could have been in there as opposed all these people as opposed to Hyun, but they Hyun in. But I see why they did that. You want to get ratings. You want to get that K-pop audience there, and they're going to be there with Hyun in. Um, but that's really that. I'm super duper excited about this season. Sonny is going to be back as the MC, which is man. Hopefully they'll bring on some female like vocalists or some female like mentors in this season, which a lot of us talked about. All in all, again, I hope I'm I'm completely anticipating how good this season is going to be. There's no little. There's not one woman that's going to be a little chum here. And that kind of makes me sad because we're not going to get our nigga, 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 nigga. Whoa. And that's fine, you know, someone will give us the comedy that we need. Um, you've been probably, or here, and she's going to cry a lot. Um, but yeah, that's really my take on Unpretty Rap Star Season 2. Um, we're two weeks, it's the 11th of September, it's going to air. Uh, so that means if you're watching it, if you need English subs, it's probably going to be out within the next couple of days. Uh, I will be reviewing each and every episode. So keep it locked, keep it pop. Thank you guys so much for watching. Tell me what you guys think about the Unpretty Rap Star Volume 2 lineup. Who do you like, who do you don't like? Uh, leave those comments in the box below. Write, like, rate, comment, subscribe. Uh, this has been Dez. Yo, this has been real. Peace to you. I'll see you guys next time.